Welcome to the great outdoors. I was asked by Derek Moosen Husenson, who I think is from Norway, um, to do a review of tent, no, sorry, fishing apparatus, specifically shelters and bivvies, which are basically bivouacs. Okay, so what I've done is I've managed to get hold of one such item. And I'm going to do you a five minute review to see if this can achieve five stars Steve Dog rating. Let's get down to the work face. Let's see what we're looking at. Welcome back. Here we are at the work face. The work face today being a bivouac. Right. Derek specifically wanted me to review the Quest Tackle Bivouac. This is what we got. Let me talk you through some of this. Okay, and we're going to talk about the construction and the functionality. There's two things you want when you're out catching fish, construction, functionality. Remember those in that order, please. Okay, first of all, we have got this bivouac is a pop-up variety tent. Very, very easy to construct. I constructed this in about seven minutes. Okay, so... One thing you'll find, this isn't a normal tent though. Guy ropes, no guys, no guy ropes, okay? What we've got here, screw in pegs. These pegs are to screw into the ground, create a secure fixing. When you're out camping, more importantly, when you're out fishing, you've got nothing to trip over. It's quite remarkable. Now, let's have a look at this. We have overhead sheltery thing. I forget what I call that. Canopy. And then look, protected zipping systems. Protected zipping systems there. And insect keep you outy things. Right, okay, in we go. Let's get into this thing. This measures quite wide, but even longer. And if we lie down on our backs, we can see there's that much room for my head. And let's go down to the feet end of things. There's my feet right down the bottom, look. That's where they normally stay. There. So this is probably about seven feet tall. Is that rain I hear? I don't know, because I'm inside a bivvy. I'm perfectly safe in here. There's an apron around here and a ground sheet. Not tied in, but this will aid with ventilation and also a window on the back that you can open up. So imagine this. We're sat inside our bivvy. This is a view out of our bivvy. I know what you're thinking, look at that. That's not a conventional fishing pond, but don't worry, you can take this to a conventional fishing pond. You can also zip these up. There's our bug outy thingy, thingy. And then what you can then do if you wanna put the whole thing up is you can, if you want, zip these things up here, then zip it up to create a private, a more cozy effect. Height wise, I know when I sit, I'm about three foot six. So this is probably four foot six. That's perfect for fishing, operational things. Okay, let's have one last look outside and then we'll give it the Steve Dog rating. It's hot in here. These tents are just so great. You don't need central heating or anything. They're absolutely perfect. Let's get outside. We're outside. That's better. It's cooling down a bit. It was so hot in there. Right. That is my review of the guest tackle bivy. One last thing I just want to show. Look at the look at the quality here. Where you've got these are called poles. Where the pole puts into uh, goes into the pole reception unit. They've made a point of strengthening the fabric in these areas. That isn't just there, guys. That isn't just there. It's there. It's there. That's the quality you get from the guest tackle bivvy. So this gets Steve's dog's star rating. Got 10 seconds to go. One, two, three, four, five. Five star rating. See you next time. Three seconds to go. Two seconds to go. See you on the work phase. Bye-bye.